All right, so call to order the uh, Planning Commission regular meeting, Wednesday, July 27th. Uh, we do roll call. Chair Quilty is absent. Vice Chair Andre. Here. Commissioner DeBolt. Here. Commissioner Gross. Here. Commissioner Lowe. Here. Commissioner Riley. Here. Commissioner Sullivan. Here. We stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <coughs> Uh, oral communications at this time if there's any individual in the audience that would like to address the Planning Commission and speak on any item uh, I guess not on the agenda doesn't appear that there is anybody so I think we can move from that we're good we have approval of minutes next but there aren't any approval or aren't any minutes to approve consent calendar none we're good we have no public hearings we're moving right along we can go to the staff report Thank you, uh, Vice Chair Andre. Uh, tonight's staff report is a real quick thing. This is a plan sign program for the Mighty Kitchen. Uh, as you all know, it's it's uh, about to open. It's uh, um, uh, doing uh, soft openings this week. But um, they have already installed a couple of signs that are uh, already part of code and fit. Uh, so they wanted to do a couple of signs that, that uh, stick, like for instance, Hello. Okay. This one sticks up above the parapet a little bit, and so that's that's what kicked off doing the plan sign program. And while they were at it, they they also wanted to um, paint these signs as well along the front facade and the back facade on the uh, um, canopy. And so those are not in the code, but they could. Uh, potentially be uh, agreed to by by you folks and uh, then the next one I would draw your attention to are the uh, parking <laughs> signs there were quite a few parking signs on the on the um, site plan that they gave us and uh, I felt like there were a few places where they could save on having as many parking signs as they they do and the reason why they they kind of need a lot of parking signs is because of the fact that as we know the uh, the uh, building is over here the parking lot is over here and this is where they're leasing spaces to to have more parking for the place so they need to act you know mark all of the spaces somehow in order to let people know where to know where to park so um basically that's it where uh, if you have any questions uh you know ask me uh, that but uh, staff supports this with the conditions that we've added to it and uh Back to you. And Mr. Craig Hoffman is in the audience oh, to right, address sorry. any of your questions. Okay. Thank you. I think uh, Tom pretty much explained uh, exactly what we were trying to accomplish with the sign program, and um, I think a, a few extra signs will just add to the overall look of the restaurant and uh, identity of it. Um, I think the added patio and the and the signs we have up there right now is is calling much better attention to it to the restaurant than when it was the spin pizza so um i look forward to your approval on this if there's any questions yes what's the scratch bar I, it, it's kind of like a scratch kitchen in the sense that uh, we squeeze all our own juices and you know we make everything fresh oh, and right. And it's not coming out, it's not coming out of okay. you know bloody mary <laughs> bottle or something like that got it okay <clears throat> no public hearing no need to open a public hearing right. do that so we just have a discussion forward. amongst us i guess i move approval with conditions i'll make i'll second it there's a first and a second roll call vote <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> okay. Sorry. Uh, Vice Oh, yes. I, I, I guess all in favor. What are we doing? Yeah. Uh, Commissioner DeBolt? Aye. Commissioner Gross? Aye. Commissioner Lowe? Aye. Commissioner Riley? Aye. Commissioner Sulfokan? 
Aye. Okay, six ayes and one absent. Motion passed. Motion. Great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I think that's it, right? No. Oh, no. You have a commission report or anything like that? Hmm? Um, are you done? Oh, do, do you uh, have anything to, to report? I don't know. No, I, I do. You do? Question, question of uh, I heard on the radio today a discussion of the uh, a granny flats ordinance that's uh, being proposed. Um, is that right for discussion yet, or should we be enlightened a little bit? You, you should start reading the news articles. There's three different laws proposed right now. We'll looking to weaken city's ability to prevent second dwelling units in the back of every property. Yeah, um, and they're coming at you in different ways for different reasonings, um, thinking that this would um, alleviate the housing shortage that we have in California. Okay. So Yeah, so please keep looking at it and take a look. We're looking at it. We're looking to see what we can do. Also, we're watching the marijuana law closely, too, to see what kind of defensive... Uh, ordinances we may need um, in order to protect our own rights so there's a lot of differing opinions coming out of different law firms about what this um, ballot initiative does it do and doesn't do so we're watching those closely and um, anytime you guys are concerned about something if you see an article click and send it over to us because we want to be prepared too right that's it i guess that's it that's it Mm -hmm. <coughs> wow, you are Everyone here for August? <laughs>